I grew up in Detroit and then moved to Farmington Hills. So, so I went to Central for a few years and then uh, went to Wayne State and uh, have a civil engineering degree, environmental engineering degree, and a couple masters as well, civil and environmental, with interest in chemistry as well. 30 years of coaching uh, a women's team, again, another, another interesting thing. It takes a different approach and a lot of psychology. My wife, Michaeline, is a, a psychologist, so that helps out a ton. I bring a lot of that in, in as well. We started out this summer uh, coming off our best spring that we've had, so we made some improvements. We did really well spring ball, competed really well with some Division II teams, which is a step up for us. And then we had a specific finite role of people that we needed to fill for 2019, and I think we got a good, uh, good incoming crew to do that. We've hosted more recruit days on campus than uh, we ever have for 19 and 20. We've had over 12 2020s on campus already. So that, that's one of those things, and they're juniors now, so that, that's really good. We have a core group of great leadership kids and great seniors this year. I mean, it just absolutely is easy to coach them. So, so a lot of those successes and that stuff, we set the process, we steer a little bit as coaching staff, and their foot's on the gas. Always challenging for the girls, and it's not anything the same old, same old. It's always new and always, you know, again, making them comfortable being uncomfortable. That's kind of the cool part. One that I put up on the board already is play in December. Right, that means you made it to nationals. Right? And I think that that's a realistic goal. You either got to win the, the conference outright or you got to win the tournament at the end. So you got two shots at that. And I think that that's one of those things that if I can get the leadership, the junior seniors hungry about, I think it's a doable, uh, achievable goal.